Welcome to part 16 of the Autodesk Inventor 101 The Basic Series. In this episode, I'll be taking a look at the rectangular pattern command and some of the options that go along with it. Picking up with the part created in episode 15, start a circular sketch on the lower right face, defining the diameter to be half an inch. Using the dimension tool, define the circle to be half an inch from the top and the leftmost surfaces of the part. Finish the sketch and extrude through the part to the next surface. From the 3D Model tab on the ribbon, go over to Pattern and choose the Rectangular Pattern option. From the Model tree, select the extrusion that was just created as the feature you want to pattern. You'll now have to define the directions of your rectangular pattern to follow. Selecting the arrow under Direction 1, highlight the top surface and left click. An arrow will appear to tell you what direction the pattern is going. If necessary, press the Reverse Direction button so that the pattern is moving along the solid part. You can now edit the number of columns and the spacing between each of the pattern features. Repeat this process for Direction 2, this time choosing the leftmost face and defining three rows for the pattern. You can also modify the spacing of the rows based on spacing, distance, or curve length. Press OK and you'll end up with 24 half-inch diameter holes in a rectangular pattern. That's it! Join me again next time for part 17 of the Autodesk Inventor 101 The Basics series, where we'll take a look at how to use the coil command.